Professor Pineco here, and as you can see, I'm in front of the gym. So I'm going to go and take on my first badge. Dun -dun -dun. All right, let's go in here. Let's take on this first guy. You avoided the long ray round. Let's see why you did that. So I've decided that I'm just going to record all of the trainer about uh, all of the gym leaders. And I'll take on youngster Jonathan. As you can see, I did a little bit of leveling to Choppy. So happy that we got him on the live stream. And Choppy is going to use Karate Chop, because I think it's fun. Should be able to kill this Geodude, no problem. Doesn't have any trouble uh, when, he's, when he's training against them in the wild. So, oh, Choppy. You're amazing, Choppy. And great name, too. <laughs> So there we go. Youngster Jonathan was defeated. Now I understand why you decided to battle with me. It's great. Do, do, do. Next guy. He says only those who want to win can challenge a Pokemon gym. But only those who win can get a gym badge. That's what I say to that. Youngster Darius sent out another Geodude. This is because that's a rock it's a rock type gym. So of course everybody has Geodudes. Onyx. Onyx. Sorry if I sound a little bit more tired today. I've had a, quite a cold the last couple days. So, I'm just really, really wanting to move on and keep going with the gameplay. And I'm not sure how much I'm going to record of the actual story. I don't think I'm going to do anything but the gym battles and the catching of the shiny Pokemon. Because one of the reasons I am doing this is just for me. I think Foresight is a great move, um, so I'm going to go ahead and learn that because it would be nice to be able to hit uh, Ghost-type Pokemon with Choppy, just in case I ever need to. He's about to send out Onyx. We're going to go ahead and keep battling. Choppy's just going to take down most of this gym, but Monkey will have his chance to shine too. I don't think uh, Fireworks will be very useful. <laughs> But we might put fireworks out just to have, just to have them out, really, because it'd be nice if everybody got a chance to shine. I just can't believe that all the Pokemon I have are shiny. It's amazing. And there goes Choppy, 207 experience for beating Darius's Onyx. He. <laughs> all right, gym leader it is. Welcome, this is the Orgburn Pokemon Gym. I'm Rorark, the gym leader. I'm one trainer who decided to walk proudly among rock-type Pokemon. As the gym leader, I need to see your potential as a trainer, and I'll need to see your toughness as the Pokemon that battle with you. Let's go get our coal badge, guys. Look at him do a little animation. Almost like it's disco dancing. All right. I think Choppy has proved that Choppy has no trouble chopping rocks. I, I'm happy. It's going to be interesting getting him to evolve. I am, because I'm going to have to do like a trade evolution. I think I'll have. To, hopefully, I can do that with my Soul Silver gain. I'm not sure, because I don't think I have any. Uh, my plot. Uh, I don't think I have my Diamond or Pearl in a place where I can trade. Ooh, level 14. Go Choppy. Already thinking that far into the future, that's right. Let's go ahead. I think we should put out fireworks. And the reason why I think we should put out fireworks is I think uh, that giving every everyone on the team, me except for Staravia, because I really don't want Staravia to get killed, uh, a chance to shine is a good idea. Oh, Cranios has Mold Breaker. We're going to go ahead and use... A little bite. See how well fireworks does. Ah, uh, you know, he did pretty good. Let's let him attack twice because we know, of course, the gym leader is going to use potions. But will the gym leader use a potion twice in a row? No, he won't. Ah, flinching. Okay, well, we tried. Why don't we go to monkey? Let everybody, everybody but Staravia shine, that is. 
don't want to do that. Okay, so we're going to use Rock Smash. So I have that, uh, I believe it's an HM. Yep. Yay, Cranianos is gone. Fireworks 148, Monkey 148. So Monkey will evolve at the end of this video, which is really great. It's gonna send out Onyx. I think I'll switch over to Choppy. Let's see if Choppy can take down the gym leader's last Pokemon. Wouldn't that be fun? Go Choppy. Do it for the team. Da -da -da. You think you can take down my next Pokemon like you did earlier? Why, yes I do. Actually, I don't think. I just know. So we're gonna use that and oh my gosh. No way, not yet, not giving up. Does that mean he's gonna use another potion? No, he's not. Is Choppy gonna take him down with Karate Chop? Even after a critical hit? Why, yes he is. There we go. Choppy saved the day. That is awesome. What, what, that can't be, my buffed up Pokemon. That's great, now we have more money to get Pokeballs. What? Monkey is evolving. I can't help it. I always sing when that music comes on. Congratulations, your monkey evolved into Monferno! Gotta love those caps. Alright, this is embarrassing. I went and lost to a trainer who didn't have a single gym badge. But that's tough. You were strong and I was weak. That's all there is. According to the Pokemon League rules, I have to give you a gym badge since you've defeated me, the leader. Here's your official Pokemon League Coal Badge. Dawn received the Coal Badge from Roark. Having the Coal Badge means your Pokemon can now use the hidden, uh, yeah, the HM Rock Smash outside of battle. You should also take this too. Obtain TM76. Uh, that team, yeah, it moved to have Stealth Rock, it's it's a move that inflicts damage when the Pokemon switch. Now, incidentally, TMs can only be taught once, basically, is what he's trying to say. <laughs> Alright, everybody, I'm going to save now. At 148 hours, we have beaten, uh, we have got our first gym badge, and we are ready to see some story and go on to the next route, catch our next team member. Thank you very much for joining me, and I really hope that all of your Pokemon shine.